really cool to share this news. Four times a year, the Hearst Foundations give millions of dollars in grants to deserving organizations across the country. Uh, in fact, 19,000 grants since this has all been created back in the 1940s. Now, the Hearst Foundation isn't directly connected to, but it is associated with our parent company here at KSEO. Hearst Television, uh, and some of the 2016 recipients are right here in Oklahoma, including OSU OKC, and we have the president, Natalie Shirley, with us. Thanks for being here with us. Oh, I'm delighted. Thank you very much. So uh, the grant money for you guys, you guys put in a grant for a simulation center at this brand new state-of-the-art Allied Health building. If you could start by telling us about this new building, because it is kind of the, the centerpiece of what you guys have been working on in some ways for the last couple of years. Oh, that's exactly right. This is a, a as you said, a new Allied Health Center for at for OSU Oklahoma City. Um, it's a 45,000 square foot building, so it's, it's, it's very large. And it's designed to house our, our phenomenal nursing program, um, our rad tech program, our sonography program, dietetics, et cetera. Um, and it is, is really going to take the, the training in Oklahoma City to a whole new level. Yeah, when I was reading about it, what I noticed uh, first and foremost was how hands-on this is going to be for students of any sort of medical program there at OSU OKC. Oh, it absolutely is. This simulation center, which the Hearst Foundation helped fund, um, is about 7,500 square feet. It has five simulation rooms in it, and they look like a, uh, a labor and delivery suite, um, an emergency room suite, a standard patient care, um, and uh, a surgical suite. And so the nurses, the dietitians, the rad techs can actually come in and practice and learn their craft. But importantly, the community can use it as well. Mm. So we have MOUs with, with hospitals that are in the works because they want to use this facility because it is such high tech and, uh, and so amazing. What I thought was cool too is they have these different rooms so you can simulate, you know, an operating room where you can simulate um, <laughs> any, any of these rooms where, where they're going to have to work every day. But then there's also a control room where it can all be monitored and then they can learn from it and, and record it back. That's exactly what happens. There's a, 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 a control room not unlike you would see in, in an airport. Um, and someone is in there making these high fidelity mannequins experience whatever it is that they're teaching that day. So, for example, these high fidelity mannequins, which Hearst helped help fund, um, have a pulse. Um, they can have a heart attack, they can throw up, um, they can do so many different things and the nursing students have to react to it. They have to treat them and if they do it wrong, the mannequin registers that. Mm. And so it's a, a, it's a training moment in a situation where no one's going to die. Sure. Um, so it, it's just really, really the hands-on experience. And, Absolutely. you know, I know you guys point out grants like these make these things possible. Have you had to rely on grants more at OSU, OKC because of the budget cuts we've been seeing recently? We absolutely do, and, and we do it in the spirit of partnership, um, and that's what we believe we're, we're doing with, with the Hearst Foundation. Um, we partner with a lot of different folks. For example, Variety Care has a clinic in that building which will provide services to low-income folks. Many of my students are low-income folks, so for the first time, they now, through this partnership, can get primary health care. They can get dental care through a generous donation from uh, Delta Dental. They can get um, behavioral health medicine. So higher ed does have to rely more on partnerships than ever before. Okay, Natalie Shirley, thank you so much thank for being you. here with us, and congratulations on the grant. Really appreciate thank your time. You.